Oh, shoot. Okay, here we are. <clears throat> I'm going to be sculpting a, another thing like I did the other day. Um, this one. So, if you haven't, if you didn't see, if you weren't here on the other day when I was sculpting, I did this little, this little hippo guy based off of Augustine's hippo. And this is for um, something new that we're doing, which is hand soap. Um, so Stephanie and Donovan are making hand soap for us, and I'm sculpting a bunch of Reftoons themed pieces for, for hand soap. Here is one of the soaps finished, and uh, it probably smells like lavender. I can't smell anything right now because I'm sick. No, it's contained in... It's also wrapped in plastic. Okay. Is work oh there it is can you hear me oh huh i can tell you that he'll just oh 
Are, are you heading on over there? All right. Well, now I see the, the little bars working on the microphone, so it looks like it's working. Um, okay. Thank you. All right. So if you didn't hear me, if, if, if there was no sound earlier, then... Um, so what I'm doing is I'm going to be sculpting a new, uh, a new sculpture for <laughs> sculpting a new sculpture for um, making soap, Reftoons flavored soap. And uh, right now I'm just kind of heating all this clay up. You want me to say that and see? Sure, if you don't mind. Mm -mm. It's gonna have some. Yeah, if there's no way to fill it. Are the kids to come? Here. Um, I got these ones. Time to shut off, guys. Yeah, does someone want to come over here and uh, heat heat up this clay? Just make it make it more malleable. And uh, I don't think they know what that means. Make it more uh, soft. <laughs> here, take this. Here's some. Just oh. twist it, and when you break it, Paul, it like it crumbles almost. Yeah, I know. So can we just twist it? Yeah, just twist it. Okay. Just, just kind of. You don't have to break it apart. Just kind of do that in your hand. It's open then. Hi. Can I? No, we need you to make this soft. Okay. Yeah, can you squeeze these? Here, Harper, is it off? Squeeze it. Don't yeah. pull it apart though. Oh. All right, I'm gonna. Okay. You don't like twist it like this and turn it off. Oh, bring it in the next one. I'm actually going to. Ah! Where'd that go? Bailey? Oh, you're still talking. <clears throat> you're going to reuse some of this, I think. Yeah, you could use that for the inside. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. Is that. Need to break it apart a little bit. How soft is soft enough? Yeah, it's gonna be hard. I don't know. It's gonna warm it in your hands. So. Okay. That's not fun. Yeah. Bless you. Are you getting sick too? I am. Uh oh. Does your throat feel funny? I can't stop you. Yeah. Okay. Well. Do we want this to be similar size as this, this or one? a little smaller? Wait, what are you making? Making a stony heart. Ooh. And on the inside, it's going to be what, McKenna? Wait, why do you have be like egg on the inside? That's not on. It's oh. just the. There we go. On the inside, it's going to be a new heart. A new heart, that's right. Teeny tiny. Like. But beautiful. It is tiny. Probably. Actually, you're probably. Oh, well, yeah, maybe. Can I have a piece of clay? Can the ocean live at all? You gotta, you gotta soften it, okay? And then can yeah. I? You can work on no, this. No, that needs it. Really? <clears throat> work on this. Oh, I did do a good job on that. Okay, who's who's getting the, the clay all? Is it? Is this? Is this soft enough? I think it is. That's okay. Thank you. How's this one? Could I have one? Hold on. Um, <clears throat> okay, yeah. Switch over. Here, I'm gonna do this. I forgot to hop on the Instagram. Oh, that's our street. That is our street. You gonna go check it out? No. No. All right. So I need this. This. How big should the heart be? I wonder. That helps me. Is it good enough? Yeah. Looks good. Okay, I'm just gonna do. Triangle for now. Yes, sorry, that one hurts. Oh, was that now? Hmm? I just oh. need that. Mm -hmm. oh. Okay. oh, you might want to use this as an example. 
Or side, side. Side, yeah, that's going to be way too thick. Well, by the or end is of it. Um, you have a one inch thing going inside there. Yeah, and one inch. But it's going to be, well, like let's see what the... Or so. Where's the, uh... Is there a ruler over there, Dave? Mm. Where's your ruler? Where's... Oh, you have one out. Can I? What? Didn't you have a ruler out? Okay, one second. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get Instagram streaming here. Where's the white one? Oh. Oh. Can I build this thing? Oh. Well, no. Uh, actually, Dad's gonna need it for his heart. What? Did you find something? A ruler. Oh, honey. Oh, thank you. That's perfect. It's point nine of an inch, which means it's just barely under an inch, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. That was probably good. Let's make a happy face. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Oh, there's only one. Wait, is this yeah. one? Oh, this one's soft. Oh, oh you made it hard. Wait. Harper just did yeah. it for you. She did? Yeah. Oh, okay. thanks, Harper. I guess we're done. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Oh. All right. Oh. Oh. Would it so. look like an organ or like an organ? An organ. No. The organ kind of part? Not so unrealistic. Cartoony looking. What is that? You want to look out the window and see what's going on? That sounded like a motorcycle. Oh, okay. I don't know. No, but I can move in. Oh, okay. Yeah, he was on a motorcycle earlier. Great day for it. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, you said there's going to be a one inch heart, so it needs to be thick enough. Well, we can. We, well, I'll thicken it with the, the thickness of the heart doesn't matter necessarily. Okay. So but what does matter is the, the width here. of it. All right. Okay. So I need two. Oh, one inch is going to be. It's going to be just under an inch. So we'll just pop that in. Okay. And then we'll just make it as short as it Harper, needs to be. Or McKenna, do you want to make me a one-inch heart just so I can have a reference? Yeah. Oh. Use the ruler here. Okay. Yep. Thank you. <clears throat> Point nine of an inch, that's close enough, right? Uh, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna... Can I do Play-Doh? I'm trying not to make it very big. Stop it. It's the... Um, the Play-Doh? No, 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 no. Oh. Okay, yeah. Okay, so it should Flatten be it. Exactly. Hold on. Do you want to get a clear one? It's like making pizza. Wait, what about Harper's heart? I know, right? She had a really nice. Mm -hmm. Way nicer than this one. How do you do that? Like, I took a long thing and then folded it and curled it in. And maybe a smaller piece would be. Oh, that might be. Oh no, that's too big, isn't it? Oh, I need my. Uh... <clears throat> Where's my? I want to have my exacto knife. Yeah, I had it with the soap. Oh. I'll grab it. <clears throat> there. Okay. The gray one. That's good. What's on Pedro? Thank you. That's good. Uh, yeah, that'll be good. Thank you. Well, no, is it? Can is I, it? Is it the? Is it the right size? Did you measure? Mm -hmm. 
I just oh, it's over an inch. I just, it doesn't have to be a perfect part, but it just needs to be a placeholder. Okay. All right. That's going to be still way too thick, right? Or it needs to be thick enough to have the other heart inside of it. How thick do you want the other heart? It doesn't matter how thick it is. Inch. As long as it's buried a little bit in there. Okay. Set that aside there. Oh, I need the ruler too. Oh, that's gonna be. I'm gonna do just a triangle, but this is gonna be. Actually, actually, I'm just going to do this. There we go. Oh, I got it done first. I need me. Mm. Okay, I'm taking some of this out. I don't need all that. Too much in there. Try it a different way. Is clay inside of here? These? Hmm? Is clay inside of these? Uh, no. Okay. What is it? <laughs> I do not understand. Noise is someone making tea? No. What's this? Oh. It's <laughs> someone <laughs> making tea. Hello. I do not know how to pronounce your name. I'm going to attempt it though. Shah Hasia. Thank you for the, uh, I believe. Facebook, it's stars. Yes, 99 stars. Thank you. Appreciate it. Oh. Where's our bell? <laughs> we don't have our bell anymore. Get the bell? I don't even know where it is. Yes. Where is it? I don't know where it is. Oh, I think it's in the box downstairs. Oh, you put it where in. I... No, it's in that box what? right there. That's not. Yeah, what is that box? That's not. Those are. I don't know what they're. Maybe we just had it. That might be more. Did? Yeah. Oh, that, wait, what? So, oh, yeah, it's in that box. Oh, it is? Box, yeah. Wait, do you mean the orange box? Do you All right, it? there we go. Thank you. Mom? Is someone making tea or something? I heard a ding. What is it? I thought someone was... Heating up water for tea. Okay. All right, let's uh, let's do this here. There, I got my base. Doesn't look quite like a heart, Ew. but it will. Don't worry. It will. I was wondering why someone would just say that. Oh yeah, it shows up the differently on, on here than it does on Facebook. Oh boy. I would probably expect it to be about that thick in the middle. Okay. Because if I mean, because then you'd get a decent little layer down here, underneath of this one, right? Right. A little bit more on top. Yeah. So, so like, you don't need any more. Foil? Nope. I've got all the foil I need. I've been foiled. Mm. <laughs> all those plans. My plans have been foiled. Alright. This is going to go around the base here. 
just to give it a little something perfect. Get ourselves a uh, so may I sit here? I can grab a different seat. Oh you can you can do that. Oh, <laughs> You're welcome. I appreciate your work and art for God's glory. And you pronounced my name almost right. <laughs> Excellent. What are you making, by the way? Well, um, uh, last week or last few weeks, I sculpted this hippo based on Augustine's hippo, Augustine of hippo. And I made, I sculpted this so that we could have our own custom soap mold for soap we have some lavender hippo soap available at reftunes.com and i'm today i'm making another sculpting another mold for another thing of soap which will be a heart like a, it's going to be a stony heart with um <laughs> with a um a new heart inside so we'll see it's kind of an experiment kind of very much <laughs> i'm really hoping it works what yeah. do you think kenny what you think do hope it works yes definitely Gotta who wouldn't kind of slowly build this up <laughs> it's not gonna it doesn't look like much right now but as I build it up it should start to take shape I thought this was my roller and I thought <laughs> I got these confused <laughs> oh that's hippo's cute I love it nice idea for the heart thank you <clears throat> okay, let's see. It's okay. Oh, I like yeah. this, and I'm going to pinch that in the middle. Good evening, oh, maybe that's... I joined after you began. What material are you working with? Hey. I'm working, this is polymer clay, is what it is. And aluminum foil. And aluminum <laughs> foil. <laughs> Something different. Not drawing tonight, just sculpting. Ooh. For another bar of soap. <laughs> this is, uh... Would you say this is yours and Donovan's project? Yes. <laughs> and I love it. Stephanie and Donovan have their soap soap project that they're working on. And uh, I'm making the molds here. And I keep hitting that light. <clears throat> All right, that'll do. I think you're done. All right. <laughs> okay. I think I'm going to make a shit that just got cut. Do you want my um, tools? No. Nope. Oh, yeah, okay. No, nope, they're good. These will do. How's it look? No. Yeah. <laughs> it's a toupee. <laughs> Hello, says Cavendish Bros. Hello. How you doing? Oh, she says, so the mold is made out of the polymer clay. What is the soap made out of? Well, I could read you the ingredients. Eleven. Uh, let's see. What is the soap made out of? Steph? That is actually, that's, yeah, that's Steph's, uh, 
we area there. I was looking into cold process soap, but that you have to deal with chemicals that I don't want the kids handling, and that's this was their project with me to work on. So I actually bought melt and pour soap where you don't have to deal with like the lye and things like that. That would that would be a little bit more difficult to work with. So the soap that actually we're using for the hippo is um it's just called a white uh, soap base. It has coconut oil, palm oil, safflower oil, glycerin water, sodium hydroxide, sorbitol, propylene glycol, uh, sorbitan oleate, goodness, this is so small, <laughs> oat, oat protein, titanium dioxide, and then I use mica colorant mixture in with the soap to get the uh, coloring. It's also scented with lavender 4042 essential oil. So that is the hippo, but as far as the heart that Paul's making, the inner heart, the new heart, if you will, will be made of glycerin soap, similar uh, melt and pour, so the process is uh, safer for our use at home. For kids, yeah, to and, be making. And then, uh, but that's so why the outer one is going to be the white, white soap base. It's going to be gray, and then the kind of the pinkish red heart in the middle is glycerin, so it's more transparent or translucent which one is it uh both <laughs> i don't know um trans transparent like light so you can go through but you can't necessarily see entirely then it would be translucent probably because it's not completely clear or see-through but it's yeah right holds a like, brighter color you can't really see through it so right. that, that will be a blend in the outer layer of that what scent was it going to be it was going to be peppermint and then i now this is a, this one's a trial experiment so the outer <laughs> layer will be peppermint the inner layer will be lavender so we'll see if that works right mr reptunes is a legend oh kill it kill it what ew ew ladybug oh, not with a knife oh don't poke it uh, almost <laughs> Hey. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Dad, Just kill it. Chop it in kill it. On, I can't do it on camera. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <Where did> it... <laughs> it almost flew into my mouth. Well, there. It's on my light. I got it. Oh, okay. Oh. You didn't. Oh. <laughs> 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 okay, well, that was enough excitement. <laughs> Mayoshi, says, Mayoshi says, thank you. Great idea. There, we're back on track. Back on track. <laughs> I'm Lady Buggy. <laughs> Ladies Man Line, how you doing? Haven't seen you in a while, except for last night. Was it last night when he was on? I don't know. Or was it the night before? Probably the night know. before. I don't think you were. Oh, did you? Was I? I don't remember. I don't know. I've been going live a lot. Yeah, just like turning on the music and just keeping it live on live while I draw. <laughs> Sal Pasio says, "LOL, don't kill it." Oh, it's a little late for that. <laughs> 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 you know, we have let them outside before, but that's a very rare occasion. Maybe when Paul is not home to kill it. That's that's. Yeah. Yeah, we have. Because Harper wants to keep. Otherwise, pets, otherwise they're an we'll infestation. Flush, we'll flush them. Yeah. We all, when we first bought this house, they were everywhere. But I think it was because of the hole in the attic that uh, we got the flying squirrel from. Oh, could have been, but no, I don't think. I think it's more from the, the basement. You do? Yeah. Well, let's get rid of the basement. Fill it in. <laughs> Fill it in. <laughs> get the cement truck. <laughs> <laughs> Just put up a cement wall where our basement door is supposed to be. <laughs> Never get the stuff down there again. Yeah. How would we do our laundry? How would you do our laundry? <laughs> he we make the door. that room airtight. Okay. Then we only open the door to get in and you seal yourself in. Go down with a bee seat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm building it up so I can tear it down. I'm gonna I'm gonna use one of these one of these things to kinda sculpt 
um, like, uh, what's it called? Surface, surface areas that you, that makes it look like a rock, like a chiseled rock, chiseled areas. I don't know. <clears throat> Oh man, not only is my nose stuffed, but my eyes feel like they're burning. Is that weird? I don't know. It doesn't normally happen, does it? No, it almost feels like I'm allergic to something. Oh, it could be. He's allergic to me. Should we check the yeah. pollen? <laughs> oh, pollen. Let's see what it is. Wonderful. I've never been allergic to pollen before. Or have I? I just didn't know it. <clears throat> okay, I have to uh, blow my nose. Diatomaceous earth is a great natural repellent. Those are a type of beetle rather than ladybug. We have them at our place. North Carolina, they're awful. Yeah, they are. Um, yeah, we have diatomaceous earth, and we do use that. We sometimes... Oh, okay. Huh. Maybe I am reacting to the pollens, then. Maybe we're reacting to the ladybugs. Maybe the ladybugs, too. <laughs> You're allergic to beetles. Yeah, I'm allergic to bees. Oh, Just that would be one. Would be considering we just set up a beehive. Oh, lovely. Oh, there's a tipsy dragon, I think. Mm -hmm. Kind of with the wrinkles on my finger. Mm -hmm. It feels like mm -hmm. mm. <clears throat> Let me use this to kind of smooth out a lot of these areas here. Oh, we used to use, we have used diatomaceous earth before, but that was for... Yeah, we I still have we, some. We've used it around by the chicken coop and stuff. But we've used... Or no, I had in, the, in the garden. For the centipedes. Right, I remember that. And but, but I vacuumed it. Oh, you did? Okay, I thought it was still down there. <laughs> well, there may be some, but I mean, that was was still a little bit. Well, we haven't had as many centipedes. Oh, well. <laughs> no, well, I vacuumed it, so there may be some there. It also has been kind of winter. Oh, I'm not sure. Yeah, probably not. Now, but. Actually, I wonder. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. We had uh, to sharpen the thing that I made. Uh, no. Oh. I destroyed it. Does it cook? <laughs> I don't know. Way any different than. Uncooked weight, so probably four point six. Well, that all depends on what you have on the inside of that too. Yeah. Do you want to weigh this too? Hang on a minute. I'm yeah. getting... <coughs> One moment. Stephanie's gonna weigh it. Three point two. How much but was the other? Got, you've got a bit more. Uh, you have less surrounding it. How much was that? Four points. Oh, okay. And it's 
So this one just feels thicker. But you need the room for the inner one. Right. As well. So that's good. Too. Yeah, but we saw a flower. Huh? And Dolan told me it was a flower, so I made it one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, like a tulip. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Don't even know it's a flower. Okay. It's a sun. Ah, okay. Just kidding. Donna and I. She's gonna be. It's. Um, it's gonna give it to me. Oh. Okay. Now. <laughs> Let me tube. Oh, McKenna made a flower. You wanna put it over here? Beautiful. So tight. <coughs> it's supposed to be what are you talking about well I have a circle on my wrist when I'm watching oh. and then I took it off like a while ago Tom said it was a flower the holy grail the holy grail <laughs> <laughs> that light coming out of it worms no <laughs> <laughs> at first I had oh, it not have yeah I know I have an actual rolling pin. Yeah. Or I could use alcohol and get some of that off. I think or was it peroxide? I got some of it off. Yeah, I remember we got some off the other ones. Or should we use one of the other ones that is clear? I don't know where they are. You gave up? Huh? You give up? No. I had this exacto knife since I was in high school. I can't read it either. It's 836. 36, okay. I don't think you need to read it. Love you, good night. Harper? Oh. It's bedtime. 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 Mm. Mm. Right. Can I come to somewhat of a point here? What? Oh, Bailey, honey, you scared me a little bit. No. Here, I'll come back up now. Okay. Good night, Mary. Ah. Can I talk to you? Oh, uh, yeah, what are we reading? Mm. Push it here. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Come to the door. Yeah. Here, don't forget. Mm. Good night. You think that'll be done tonight? Rugged yeah, bolt? probably. Probably, yeah. Oh, another one? How many kids do we have? Good night. Six. <laughs> <Four>. <laughs> and what? And probably just one for mom. Someone for mom. One, a hug and kiss. Oh, my nose is running. Where's the Kleenex? You could have baked that right into the heart. I know. Little piece of pearl in every soap bar. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, my nose is stuffed, and so I can't really, it, I can't really blow anything out of my nose. So it just runs, and I can't control it. Oh, it's terrible. You want to hear more of my problems, huh? <laughs> if you need to yeah. let loose, Paul, we're here for you. <laughs> Okay. Oh, you should make it look just like this. Yeah. Stone. Stone, yeah. That's the, the idea. That's the big idea. Your finger wouldn't have smoothed out? No, this works better.
Is that giving it a little, oh, well, I guess a little bit of space so that, uh, like, height. Height. Um, it's about the same. I, I, so that we don't, when we fill it, it gets all that jagged edge that's hard to kind of, do you know what I mean? When, oh, you mean at the bottom? Y yeah. I'm going to try to flatten this to okay. the board so that there's so that none of the molding oh, oh, material okay. can get okay. into there. Yeah. That way it'll hopefully come out do a better job at uh, like that. All right, I'm going to try to What's your warning? Mold this. The stream on YouTube is oh. being weird. Mm. So it's good. <clears throat> okay. Mm. Oh, you're to the sculpting part now? Maybe. We're going to find out. Okay. I may have to use a different tool. This stuff doesn't sculpt like the... Uh, like the clay I used in college. What's he making? I can't tell. Sorry, he says theology nerd. Ah, oh, it's okay. Making... <coughs> Bacon. Making a heart. It's going to be... It's a mold for, so I, I did this hippo earlier, so I'm making a stony heart. So I'm going to try and make it look like it was chiseled, chiseled a little bit. In theory, this worked. You don't <laughs> I just haven't gonna... tested it out in the real, real life. Oh, you're scaring me a little bit. What about if it doesn't go so good hand molding? Could do you think a three D program would? No, I think this will be just fine. Augustine the hippo. Augustine's hippo. Augustine's yeah. hippo. Yeah. And then did you tell him that it's going to be made into soap? No, I didn't. But you just did. Yeah. <laughs> there it is. These are actually on the website. The hippos are on the website right now, but we we'll make some more later. So, oh, okay, that makes sense. Thanks. Okay. <laughs> Someone's playing Amazing Grace on the harmonica. It sounds like they're in jail or something. It does. <laughs> I was just going to say, sounds like someone's in trouble or mourning something. <laughs> it's kind of weird. When do you expect the heart to be on the website? Uh, I'd like it I'm not made. sure. Well, we still are. Ex we still need to wait for some of the stuff. The, the materials to make the soap it's shipping. are coming. It's sh it's the, the it's we gotta get the shipping notice, so it'll be. I, I would probably give it two weeks. Um, depending on when that stuff gets here, to do it, because this shouldn't take you the too long to do the heart one, right? Right. Okay. So really, we're just gonna start with three different soaps. Did you tell them the other soap idea? Uh, no, I did not. Or plan and idea. The other soap is going to be, um, tombstone soap. It's going to be shaped like a tombstone, and on the tombstone it says, here, it says in big capital letters, SIN, S-I-N, instead, instead of R-I-P. Um, and then it says, here lies the old man, or the old, so. the old self. Um, and then it has two scripture verses on it. 
and those will be kind of just carved into there but that my that one i did in a 3d program and my brother is going to be 3d printing that one and that for me about two weeks as well so that i can make a mold out of that that one will be with gray mica powder it'll be scented clove i think right is that what we decided oops i think it was clove uh yeah i believe so and just simple with the same uh, white soap base as the hippo yeah okay so you can't really see what i'm doing here and kind of carving off the side here they still can't see <laughs> Because we wanted a project for us to do. <laughs> what? You're doing this so that I can have a project with the kids. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I'm so thankful. You're welcome. It's so fun. How do you know like, what a stone looks like? Do you have to look at a stone? Mm. No, I'm just making it a stylized stone in my from what's in my head. You, you know. Of course. Everything in your head makes. <laughs> I don't know what you draw from. It's so much up there. <laughs> I don't either sometimes. The idea is just to give it some hard edges, sharp corners. Are you going to make two and go with your best one? Nope. It's just the hardest what you get. Yep. And that's the nice thing about the stony heart is that you're working with pretty simple I, shapes. I can make it pretty stylized how I want it to be come on That piece off of there. Oh yeah, I like that. How that looks right there. That little piece off of there. Now, can you hold it up so they can see kind of some of the ridges that you're doing? Because it doesn't look like it has changed really. Yeah. So there you go. That's what I'm doing on there. Just some of these. Sharper corners, sharper, as if someone's taken a, a hammer and a chisel and just ch 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 chiseling things off. Oh, do you think it would be easier to just put it in the oven and then mold it down when it's hard? No, this is going to be easier because um, I have more control this way. You wouldn't like sand it down or anything? No. Plus, this is this is this is a plastic-based clay. All that dust from that. Oh, would be bad. It's just nasty. Okay. It's so weird. I feel like I would enjoy it better if it were like. Fast forward. <laughs> or if I was doing it myself. Yeah. But 
I know where we're going with it, so there's a problem there. <laughs> I'm gonna stick some of that in there because there's a big gap down there that's gonna fill with the molding material if I don't cover it up. Show me. I'll work with it if it. Yeah. Just gotta make sure that this is completely flat on the base because the hippo was not completely flat on the base. And so oh, I see. the molding yeah, material got went right under there. And so we had a lot of trimming to do on the on the mold when I made the mold. Well, well, and on the soap. And on the soap. Which will be... Unless we don't fill it to the top. Or to like the tippy top where it's level. Yeah. So. She says, thank you for doing these live demos. Very informative. God bless your work. Looking forward to the finished products. Thank you. Thanks for tuning in. Good to see you again. I need to look at it at the top there. There we go. All right. <clears throat> Maybe if you could color that so that you can see. Like if you worked in a little bit of color under that. Would it well, be I think if I had different that color. different colored clay, the brownish grayish clay stuff. Oh, you'd be able to see I'd it. I'd be able to see it better. Yeah, I feel like the lighting has to be just right to see how it's actually going to turn out. Too. And I'd probably get that, that oil-based regular clay stuff. Well, this stuff's oil-based. This just stays, I mean, he is. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. It's just a lot easier to work with well, then, than this. This, it's a little, it's more moldable and more forgiving. And you can smooth it out better than you can with this stuff. Alright, Tuesday, all of Stephanie's soap will be here, so they can start making stuff on Tuesday. Uh-oh. Getting down to the under layer here. It's showing through. Kind of hard to see all the shadows. This white clay does not. It's not let me see it very well.
Oh, big old bubble there. Cover that up, smooth that out, and actually I might have some more in there because now there's a big issue and now that's going to need to be smoothed out all over. Oh, got some, got some air bubbles in there. See, there's one right there. It's getting smaller and smaller. Yeah. Maybe we should have done it a little bigger. I don't know. No, I don't know. Tom? Got some air bubbles in there that I had to pop. Oh, no. Now, if there's an air bubble underneath there somewhere, it's not going to be a huge deal because... N no. It'll be... It wouldn't be a huge deal. Okay. It's not like they would pop. Mm -hmm. After it's cooked. Or could it cause a problem in heating? I don't think so. Okay. Is that too thin then? Does it need to be taller? No, no, because the heart that's going to be on the inside will probably be about that big. So you could even probably whittle it okay. down quite a bit. All right. But And then I would expect it to be, well, we would have to make sure that it's smaller than this. Yeah. Shorter than this because you'd have to have, yeah, I don't okay. know. You can have it. I wouldn't go any shorter than okay. that. But you might go... If you used gloves, would that not get your fingerprints in there? Uh, can you do that? That would be really hard to use gloves. You actually shouldn't use your fingers at all because it transfers dirt and everything. That's why you use the tools. Mm. So we just rubbed it all in our hands. How do you do that without touching it? Then well, I mean, I don't know. Yes, if you're... If you're not using, like, the colored clay and everything to make colored things, then it doesn't matter. That's usually... I forget that that's... That's why they say that, is because... There's different colors of this clay and some people use the different colors to make make things by combining the different colors like a green stem with a pink flower and, or whatever so they don't have to paint it and then they bake it to harden it like that so if you're doing that you don't want to get dust in it because the dust will show do you want to, um, <coughs> excuse me, do you want to wait until we get the right kind of clay to hmm? do this or? Is no, no, fine? this is fine. This will be, this is fine for this. Can you bake the other kind of clay? Uh, depends on what kind you get. Gray. I mean, you can get gray plasticine, so which is what this is, which you would have to bake or, or there's oh or there's stuff that oh they don't even see what i see oh man oh there's a big hole there's a air bubble caused a hole there
Wow, that's a big divot. <laughs> Risk it? No. Was that a big hole or just? Yeah, it must have been where a big, uh, big air bubble. Big air bubble was. Because it pressed into it and it just went in. You could have a worm coming out of it. Yeah. Do you want them listening to music tonight or no? Um. I don't care. They can. Yes. Is there a different angle you could have the light where they would be able to see better what you're doing? Do you know what I mean? Like that. Oh, there. You know what I mean, Vern? Oh, uh -huh. Like that. Well, maybe, because yeah, you feel like you see the divots better. Yeah. A little bit? Yeah. Do you need that screen or? It might be quieter. Yeah, I do need that screen because it's um, charging my phone. I can put your phone on the mm -hmm. charger. No, you can't because it's right there. It's filming. Oh. <laughs> oh, yay. There's no place else you can plug it into? <clears throat> there might be something on the other side of the... You could probably unplug the camera and then plug the phone into there. The that Logitech camera there. This thing. Do you even use this thing? Typically, I use that one when I'm going.